Hello fellow Scratchers! Welcome to the Griff Patch Academy Game Jam winners video. Our theme this time was in a big world and I cannot wait to show you what everybody created. Today we're nominating some special winners, nope not by game genre this time, instead we've got six unique awards. Best technically cool, most diverse game, most amusing, best upgraded remix, best boss battle and best collab. So without further ado let's blast through the top 25 submissions that best captured the theme in a big world and see if you can guess which ones are taking home those special awards. Enough talk, let's get started. Number one, Alone in a Big World by Robodog81. A technical marvel. Play as a hungry slug in a barren world. Will you munch on cabbage or get scorched by those dynamic sun rays? That is one cool effect. Number two, Ants by Jenny4466. A creative take on the classic clicker. Get those ants moving to rack up those points. How cute is that ant hill animation? Number three, Around the World by Binky Beaver. A platformer with a twist. Travel the world while collecting fascinating facts. I love the educational spin here. Who knew learning could be this fun? Number four, Atom by Atom by Not A School Account. Merge and match on a massive scale. Start with atoms and work your way up to, well, I won't spoil it for you. Try it out. The universe is your oyster. Number five, Big Money in a Big World by Luki Kabuk. Dash around the globe in this casual clicker. It's a slow start, but when you win, it's big. Can you catch up to the cash? Number six, Day of the Life of an Ant by Fagner Marcelino HC. Hilarious twist. Explore the backyard from a tiny ant perspective and get ready for some laughs along the way. Ant-sized comedy at its best. Number seven, Don't Bug Me by Smile Hedgehog. With big expectations weighing on your, uh, squidgy body, do you have what it takes to become the bug you were destined to be? Number eight, Endless in an Infinite World by Mangoes Jangos. Trapped in a boring job in the equally boring infinite world, do you have what it takes to escape this clever puzzler? Number nine, Evolution by One Dimensional. Fight to survive from cell to insect, cat to bird, so many genres all in one game. Super fun to play. Can you master every level of evolution? Number 10, Flappy Bee Survivor by Key Colette. Flappy Bird meets Scrolling Platformer. Collect honey without touching the sides. Easier said than done, right? How long can you last? Number 11, Gravity Ant by Bap Attack. Who knew ants had anti-gravity powers? Well, that actually makes a lot of sense. But do you have what it takes to beat this topsy-turvy game? Number 12, Honey, I Got Shrunk by Game Vision TV. Get blasting in this epic shooter. Everything is huge when you're bug-sized. Those enemies though, massive. Feeling small yet? Number 13, In a Big World by Dashasaur. You're an alien, collecting world monuments. Test your geographical skills in this clever and quirky game. How many landmarks can you <laughs> borrow? 14. Inside a Big World by Adeskatha. Scrolling, leveling up, mini maps, this game has it all. A brilliant showing from an up and coming scratcher. I cannot wait to see what you make next. Number 15. Lemonoid Invasion 2 by Geometric Coda. An epic, fan made sequel, giant map, big bosses, shields. Oh man, this is one lemon filled battle you won't forget in a hurry. Number 16. Little Ants in a Big World by Nether Dragon 222. Some fantastic coding here. Spawning ants to collect leaves and they continue working even when off screen. Ah, watch out for those anteaters. Number 17, Planet Clicker by Clumsy Hamster. A strangely addictive clicker with a glowing world. Just click away and enjoy the view. How many clicks can you rack up? Number 18, Project Big World by Hubert13. When there's not enough space in your world, sit back and watch the chaos unfold in this crazy animation. It's great to see a whole family collab. Number 19, Quack Attack by Dave McIngoo. An RPG where a duck crash lands on a planet and has to rebuild their rocket. Watch out for those pesky birds. Will you be able to help this little duck get home? Number 20, Spaceship Game by Minecraft Gamer 1000. Impressive world building. Fly through space, land on the moon, collect rocks in 3D and then return to Earth. So imaginative. Ready for your space mission? Number 21, Stomp 
by S209432. Challenge mode activated. You're a tiny mouse trying to survive in a world of stomping feet. Seriously, this gets tough. Can you survive the Stompathon? Number 22, Teeny Tiny Adventure by Pillow Static. Another ant game, but with a twist. Explore, survive, and figure out how the crafting actually works in this fun little RPG. Number 23, The Big World by Hedgehog81. You're a teeny fly, dodging frogs and birds in this fast-paced dodge game. Can you outfly the dangers of this big world? 24. The Tale of the Beetle by M and M3344. Try not to get stomped in this adorable beetle adventure. Watch out for the boots and rocks too. Think you can avoid getting squished? And finally, number 25, Unknown Depths by Grieg96. Epic boss battles ahead. Huge shout out to Cot Bull Encoder, Game Legreg, and Kesmo MC for the art in this epic collab. Are you ready to face the final boss? Well, all right, Scratchers, it's time to reveal the winners. Let's see if you picked out the same projects as me. First up, the award for the most technically cool project goes to Robodog81 for their game Alone in a Big World. This project blew me away the moment I saw it, with its real-time dynamic sun rays casting long shadows across the entire scrolling and zooming level. A technical showcase right down to the slug's rotation along the terrain. Great work. And next, the award for the most diverse game. It goes to One Dimensional for their game Evolution. Spanning multiple genres, this game kept me on my toes. I especially love the gameplay and art style and animations of the first stage with the molecules eating each other, so cool. But each evolution was a blast to play, so congratulations on your win. For best upgraded remix, Geometrical Coder took Lemonoids to the next level with Lemonoids Invasion 2. The map is giant, and it really is. The expanded level and addition of a shield added a lot of tactical depth. Oh, and did I mention there's a mini-map and boss to defeat too? Wowzers, it's a lemon-smashing good time. Congratulations. The award for most amusing project goes to... Fagner Marcelino HC for the day of the life of an ant. This short exploration game brought a tear to my eye when it transitioned into the scene from Backyard Battle, a game we've been building in the Griffmatch Academy. It's so imaginative and I love it. Next up for best boss battle, Grieg96 took the crown with unknown depths. The intense boss fights and epic gameplay kept me on the edge of my seat. Shout out to the art team too. The adorable graphics really helped carry this epic title. Finally, the last award for best collab goes to Hubert13 for Project Big World. This is so much fun. Well, 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 it's Tiny Island. This team effort truly impressed me with its creativity and teamwork. Roping in your entire family was pure genius. What a fantastic team you turned out to be. So, a massive congratulations to all our winners and to everyone who participated. Amazing job as always, as you made this game jam something special. I can't wait to see what you all come up with next time in the Griff Patch Academy. If you're interested in joining in or want to know more about the Griff Patch Academy and the courses we run, check out the link under the video. Doors are open termly and we'll be delighted to have you join us. But that is it for today. Thank you for watching and scratch on, guys.